All right guys, Brandon Northwick here. And when I was starting out in business, I never knew the amount of work that this shit actually took. I know that some of you right now watching this can relate to what I'm about to share with you. And this is gonna be the secret sauce that you've been waiting for, you've been looking for it, you've been searching the internet, you've been trying to read all the blog posts, but you haven't found it, <laughs> cause it's been hiding. And I'm about to reveal it to you right now, that one secret piece that you need to move the business forward, because a lot of us are overlooking this. If not even just overlooking it, they're not even doing it. And this one thing, is to pick up the damn shovel okay what i'm talking about today is to pick up the shovel okay a lot of times we do not do the grunt work okay if you follow folks like grant cardone andy frisella you follow the top-notch folks like even brenna Burchard and gary v they're gonna tell you that look you've got to get your hands dirty you've got to be able to pick up the shovel okay you can't expect the dirt to move if you don't pick up the shovel and a lot of us think that we're too good for it right we just we're too good to pick up the shovel and I just want to kind of knock us off all that high horse real quick and say we're not look you know it says in the scripture that he who is first is last and he who humbles himself to be last is first and what we want to do is make sure that we are picking up that shovel. We're not too good. We don't feel like our pride is too good. You can look at the folks that are making the big dollars. They're picking up the phone if they need to. They're following up with folks if they need to. They're doing things that they're not really, that they shouldn't be doing if they need to. Why? Because they're not afraid to pick up the shovel. If you are, then the business is gonna suffer. And all kidding aside, when a business suffers, I get upset, right? Because I mean, I'm in business to help businesses grow. And for me to hear certain things from folks about how, well, I don't want to, or I don't have time to, and then they followed it up with, but I still want. It's very selfish, right? We're, we're looking from a one-way street. It's like, well, I don't wanna do this, but I want to get that. Not how business works, right? Business is actual, entrepreneurship is actually a give and, a give and receive not a receive and receive. <laughs> it's not a receive and receive, it's a give and receive. And so we gotta make sure we're coming from the right angles and we also gotta make sure that we have the right mindset and we gotta make sure that we're willing to pick up the shovel. So if you like what I'm sharing with you today about then go ahead and leave me a comment right below. Give me a like, a comment, a share. If you disagree, I wanna hear from you as well. Let me know if you feel that, you know what, hey, status is status and if you're too good to pick up a shovel then you know what you shouldn't be picking up the shovel so i'd love to get that going with you let me know what you think thanks for sticking around and i'll see you on the next video take care